if you're not a quality over quantity type of girl, this is not the channel for you. I'm sorry. Go to the girls that have Shein hauls. You know what I'm saying? That's that's giving the girls quantity, okay? Hey babes, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Shaylin and in today's video, I'm bringing you babes an Aritzia summer try on haul. I know how much y'all love Aritzia and I would love to keep these Aritzia hauls coming baby, but Aritzia is not checking for your girl. They don't want to sponsor your girl. They're not hitting your girl up and baby Aritzia is not cheap. Okay, it costs your girl a pretty coin and we got a lot of stuff here y'all. This is literally probably a thousand dollars or more worth of Aritzia items okay baby so we got a long one for you guys so what I need you guys to do to help me out is give this video a thumbs up girl also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit that notification bell so you don't miss an upload baby but let's go ahead and get into all these pieces that I picked up so the first item that I want to get into is literally the most random item ever but I heard there's some hype behind this item so I had to pick it up and try it for myself and see if the hype is really there and it is the Aritzia sock these are the base ankle socks. So these went viral on TikTok. I do believe that there is an Amazon dupe out there. But y'all know me. I like to try the real thing. I'm not really a dupe girl. Like, if I have a dupe of something, it's something that is really, really pricey. Something I can't really afford at the moment. Or something that I'm thinking about investing in. But just want to see if I'm really going to utilize it in the way I want to. So I want to try the real thing, baby. So I got these socks. I think these socks are super helpful because a lot of my socks that I have like this either have a Nike logo on it or an Adidas logo. And sometimes I don't want a logo. I don't like the look of a logo. So I picked these up. They're just your very basic white ankle socks super cute nothing fancy just a very basic sock um i do believe it was 15 dollars and you only get three yes 15 dollars and you only get three pairs of socks so they're not the cheapest socks but they do however feel like a really nice thick quality so i'll have to update you guys on these later see how i feel about them um see if i feel like they're worth the money and i feel like i can only do that after i wear them but right out the pack i do feel like they're really nice high quality thick socks so i'm super excited about that and if you are like me where you do like to wear low top tennis shoes and show your socks then these are perfect because then you don't have to worry about a logo or anything like that they're just basic and plain so absolutely absolutely loving these at the moment and they do have these in a bunch of colors but i decided to go with the classic white because you can't go wrong with white socks okay they go with everything so the next item that i want to share with you guys is nothing new to you guys i actually shared this with you guys in my last aritzia haul and i loved them so much that i had to double back and get me another pair the girls were kind of dragging me for this item because y'all felt as though this item was too expensive but if you are short and curvy like me, then you know how hard it is to find trousers that A, you do not need to get hemmed or altered, and these are just the perfect pair. And since it is the summertime approaching, I had to pick up a linen pair, and these are the Effortless Pants. If you guys are not familiar with Effortless Pants, girl you need to get on the bandwagon, okay? Because these pants are everything. I do pick them up in a short length and I do pick them up in a size 10. I do feel as though these pants run a bit smaller, so I would recommend sizing up. But y'all, these are so cute, so effortless, so flowy. I feel like I can dress these up. I feel like I can dress these down. I can wear these to work. Like, girl, there's just so many different things I can do with these. I realized when I was looking through my closet that I didn't have any white pants any white trousers and i thought linen pants are perfect because linen is so easily transitional i feel like you can dress it up or you can dress it down so that's why i really wanted to pick up a linen pair and these just look so good you guys so effortless i know on camera they're probably coming up bright as hell but y'all i love these pants i'm not gonna blind y'all with them but the effortless pants are a hundred percent worth the money if you want a pair of trousers that fit you perfectly in the waist and also fit you perfectly lengthwise, please, please, please give these a try. They are classic. They are staples. You can wear these with sneakers. You can wear these with heels. I just love these and I'm definitely going to continue to buy more and more pairs of these because they are just an absolute staple in my opinion. Let me know if you guys want me to do an Aritzia staples video. That way I can share with you guys like my top, top, top items from Aritzia, like the items that I feel like I just can 
cannot be without. I know I buy a lot of items from Aritzia, but there are definitely some things that I feel like are more staple items. So let me know in the comment section below if you guys want to see that. Next item that I want to share with you guys is another thing that I am known for when it comes to Aritzia hauls, and that is a sweat shorts. Now this is a different style that I've never tried before, and this is by far my favorite style and fit on me. These are the Cozy BFs, but they are in the three inch. If you guys don't know, I am vertically challenged. I'm only five foot. And sometimes I feel like when shorts are a little bit too long on me, it just makes me look shorter, okay? I need as much of my legs to show as possible. But at the same time, I have thick thighs and I don't want my shorts to be like too short. Like I'm not trying to look like a hoochie. But at the same time, I need them to be short enough to the point where you can see my legs. So that way I don't look shorter. And these are literally per. Perfect, okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. I love the three inch. Um, I picked these up in a size medium. I could get a size large if I wanted to because they do have a drawstring, but I actually like the way the size medium fits. I feel like it still looks flattering on the bum area without looking like too tight at the same time. And it does have like a drawstring on the inside. So if you are concerned about the waist not fitting, you don't have to worry about that because this does have an adjustable waist. And the inside of this is cozy. So it does have that fleece soft lining. But because these are shorts and I've worn the cozy boyfriend shorts before in the summer, I personally don't have a problem with them. I don't get too hot in them. Again, they are shorts. And another thing I love about these, they have pockets. Pockets are so important to me, you guys. I don't realize how much I put my hands in my pockets until I don't have pockets. And I actually have a pair of Aritzia sweatshorts without pockets. And I love those, but I hate wearing them because they don't have pockets. So absolutely love these. Again, the logo is very minimal on these. As you can see, it's like the same color. And it's on the back, which I like. I don't really like a ton of logos on my basic items like this. So I feel like these type of shorts you can throw on with a crop top. You can throw on with bodysuits. There's just so many different ways. T-shirts. You can style this and wear this and I love these y'all know I'm a sweatpants girl so when it switches over to spring and summer baby I'm a sweat shorts girl okay next item that I want to share with you guys is another item that was kind of encouraged to me by TikTok I've just been seeing Aritzia jumpsuits look so good on people on TikTok but honestly the only people that I see wearing them are really really thin girls and they look like they're a lot taller than me so I just was like mm, I want to see how it'll look on my body type I am short I'm curvy and baby, I'm exactly the opposite of all the girls that I see wearing the Aritzia jumpsuits. So I picked up this one right here. It is, I believe, called the Babaton. Yes. So this is the soft contour bodysuit, baby. Anything with the word contour in it adds to cart. Okay, baby, because I need this body contour snatched in all the works. Okay, baby. So I absolutely love, love, love the color of this jumpsuit. I love a nice classic gray color. And as you guys can see, it does have detailing on it. So there's like lines across the boob. And then also in the waist. Now, I will tell you guys, this is going to be a return for me, and I'm going to tell you why. I feel as though the shorts part is too long. Like, it goes down too long on me. I'm personally just too short for this, and I feel like the band on the waist does not hit me where it's supposed to, and the length of the shorts is just too long, and I don't find it to be super flattering. When I'm wearing, like, biker shorts, I do like to them to be a shorter length, just like I like my sweatshorts, and this is too long for me. It just looks weird. It looks awkward, um, and if I do try to shorten the shorts, Shorts, I find that I get a lot of bunching in like the stomach and the waist. I did pick this up in a size medium, which I do believe is my perfect size, baby. It's not getting small over here. I can't remember the last time I gave small. And if I, if it's giving small, usually that means the items run big, okay? I really liked this and I had high hopes for it, but I do wish they came out with this in a short version and I think it would be more flattering and suit me a bit better. But yeah, I'm just not a fan of it, you guys. I just feel like it doesn't do enough for the body yada yada, especially not for $68, baby. For $68, I need you to give body yada yada and I just feel like it. my butt looks great in it, don't get me wrong. I do feel like there is some contouring, but just the length of the shorts to me just makes it not as flattering on me because I am so short. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below. Am I tripping? Is it cute? Or do y'all see what I'm saying? But yeah, this is going to be a return for me, baby. My mind's made up. Okay, yeah, she's going back, back. So the next item I picked up specifically for a party event that I'm going to, I'm 
taking my sister somewhere and I needed a dress that I felt like was appropriate, very family friendly, you know, type of vibes, but also still dressy, but not doing too much. Um, so I wanted a slip dress from Aritzia for a while and just never took the plunge on them. I was just like, girl, why would I pay a hundred dollars, uh, over a hundred dollars for a slip dress when I can get a 40 to $50 one from Zara. But now that I've tried it, I'm obsessed. First of all, I got it in this a beautiful, beautiful, like peachy color. This is the Wilford only square bodysuit and it's in the coral blush color. Now they do have this in a V cut. I picked mine up in the square cut because like I said, I am wearing this on a more modest, a more modest event. And I plan on wearing this throughout the summer. I love slip dresses in the summer, especially with sneakers. Definitely gonna throw this on with my Vejas. I think that would be such a cute look, a cute vibe. I picked this up in a size medium and it fits perfectly. I think because I am curvier, slip dresses just tend to look really, really good on me because you can see my curves through the slip dress. I do feel like this is really modest because of the neckline. So I feel like this is something I can wear around my boyfriend's mom, my boyfriend's family, you know, around high schoolers, where I'm about to be in a little bit, which I'm not excited about. But anyways, <laughs> so yeah, I picked this up and this color is gorgeous on my skin. I would never think a color like this would look good on me, but when I tried it on, it just looks so cute, so stunning. I love the way it hits. It just looks amazing, you guys. 100% recommend their slip dresses. I just feel like slip dresses are super versatile because you can dress them down with sneakers or you can choose to dress them up with heels for maybe like a wedding or, you know, any type of dressy, sort of classy event. So I love, love this slip dress and I definitely think I need to go back and get me one in black. So the next item that I wanna share with you guys is a crop top and this is from the Sculpt Knit Collection. If you are unfamiliar with the Sculpt Knit Collection from Aritzia, baby. I feel bad for you because this collection is it. Okay, I'm sorry if this white looks crazy bright on camera, but maybe it's nothing I can do about it. Okay, she's shining bright like a diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. Okay, that's enough. But I really love this top. It is a one shoulder little crop top. I love this top because it is not too crop. I want to show a tiny bit of midriff, but not too much. I think this top would look super cute with some trousers if I wanna go for a more dressier look or I can dress it down with like some cargos and some sneakers for like a more streetwear look. So absolutely, absolutely love this. The quality of the sculpt knit tops are just amazing. Super stretchy, super thick. This is not see-through at all. I picked it up in a size medium and this was $58. So they are not cheap, but they are just staples that you're gonna have in your collection for a very, very, very long time. So 100% recommend investing in these. They do have a bunch of different styles. Then I decided to pick up another sculpt knit top because like I said, I love me a good sculpt knit top. And I picked it up in this beautiful matte pearl color. As you guys can see, it has a collar. I am usually not a collar girl. I usually don't really like collared shirts like this on me, but this top is so freaking flattering, you guys. It is so flattering. I love this matte pearl color from Aritzia. It's one of my favorite colors from them. It is a very cool neutral tone, which I adore. Again, pick this up in a size medium. This one was $58. And it just looks so cute, so flattering. Again, the same as the other Sculpt Knit top. I feel like I can dress it down or dress it up. I can throw this on with trousers and heels for a more dressy look. Or I can throw this on with trousers and sneakers or cargo pants again just so many different ways to style and wear this like i said the sculpt knit tops are so nice the quality is amazing they're super thick and i just know these are items that i'm going to have in my collection for a very 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 long time one thing about me and my wardrobe i like to have a ton of high quality basics i feel like a lot of people who feel like they don't have anything to wear is because they don't have basics in their wardrobe and me personally i feel like you should invest in high quality basics because basics are things that you can re wear time and time again and you don't want to have to repurchase it every three times you wear it okay so you got to think about buying items like this from Aritzia from a standpoint of your cost per wear I know when people look at the price tag they like maybe $60 for one shirt when I could go to Forever 21 and get three but the thing is this is going to last you for years and years that Forever 21 top baby you got two to three washes and she's done for okay so 100% recommend the sculpt knit tops they are amazing and you guys will not regret picking these up the next item that I want to get into with you guys is a pair of leggings if you have not tried aritzia butter leggings 
baby I feel bad for you now me personally I have tried the flare ones but I've never tried like the regular leggings and I wanted to try the cheeky style specifically now I picked them up in this beautiful bluish gray color I think on camera it looks more gray but definitely in person it does have more of a, a blue tone it's like very very neutral the butter leggings feel so soft, you guys. I love these. Now, if you are a thick girl like me, you know our legs rub together and stuff like that. And one thing I love about these, because of the material, I do still get kind of like those balls in between my thighs. I'm not going to lie. I don't feel like any leggings will not give me that. But I find that with these, it does not happen as quickly. And also, I just love the way these look in the back. So this is the cheeky style. And honestly, you guys, I feel like when I wear leggings, my butt looks good. I'm going to be straight up with y'all. If you're a curvy girl and you got a booty, you know. Okay, baby, the booty going to look good in leggings regardless. Okay, so when I put these on, I wasn't like, oh my God, my butt looks huge. It was, to me, it's not giving that. Now, maybe if you don't have a butt, maybe it might do something for you. But I just feel like it, it gives regular. My butt looks the same. The butt looks good, but the butt always looks good in leggings so that's just that on that I can't really tell you guys if I feel like my butt looks extra good in these because I don't I, don't, I feel like my butt looks good in leggings period okay so I absolutely love these and I loved that they came in a short length so they are just your classic leggings I love having these leggings to just like throw on when I'm running errands doing something, need to throw on something really, really quick and go. And they are just so freaking comfortable. Now, these pair in particular, I'm thinking about possibly returning these and getting another pair because, I don't know if you guys can see, but they have like these weird lines already on it. I'm not sure why that is. I don't know if you guys can tell. It's not wrinkled there, but it's almost like it's stained or something. So I'm going to see if I can go back and exchange these because baby, these are $68. And I've tried to like let them hang out to see if it's wrinkles, but they're still there. I did pick these up in a size medium. They are the high rise and the short length. And I really, really like these, you guys. Do I feel like they super suck you in? No, but I do feel like they do smooth you out. They're just super comfortable. The buttery feeling is just top tier um so yeah definitely gonna pick these up in more colors um because now i know that they have the short length i'm definitely gonna pick these up in more colors i just don't want to get black girl because i'm just like baby how much black can you buy Meanwhile, I'm about to show y'all some nails black. I did pick up another pair of butter leggings. Now, I did already own these leggings, but I don't know what happened to them. I don't know if I accidentally threw them away, gave them away on accident. Girl, I don't know what happened, but I had to run these back. So these, again, are the butter leggings. They are in a size medium as well, but they are the flare ones. And I picked these also up in the short length. These were $78 again. Same fit and style as the last one, except for these aren't the cheeky ones. So when they're not cheeky, it just goes straight across. But on the cheeky ones, it does kind of like dip down, give you kind of like a V almost. But I really love these. Like I said, super comfortable. Love the way these flare ones look. I just feel like when you're wearing the flare ones, it looks more like an outfit. It looks more like you try. I love these and they're so comfortable, you guys. Please try these leggings because I promise you they are the best leggings. At first, I used to love the Aritzia cotton leggings. No, sis. Leave them $25 leggings alone. Y'all need to hop on these butter leggings. I'm telling you, they are amazing. And then to go with that, I picked up this top. And I'm going to just tell you off the bat, she's getting returned. I picked up this little top. So this is also from the butter collection as well. Again, super soft, nice material. It looks good on, don't get me wrong. But I bought this specifically to wear with the flare leggings and I don't like the way that they look with the flare leggings I just think the length of this is a little bit too long on me and it just looks weird with the leggings I just don't like it and I also just don't feel like I need this top like I just feel like girl you was just on your ass that's a cart also this top does have padding in it which I don't really care for that is removable though so if you do want to pick up this top it is removable it does have kind of like this crisscross action in the back this top was $58 and I picked it up in a size medium like I said the top is really really cute but I specifically picked it up for the purpose of wearing with the leggings and I'm just not vibing with it I also tried 
it on with like sweatpants to see if I liked how that looked and I was just like mm, it's okay um and to me it can't be okay for $60 okay no mm -mm. so yeah top is super cute super buttery soft same exact material um just I just don't feel like I need this in my closet in my collection so she will be returned as well and the next thing that I want to share with you guys is another basic I feel like Aritzia everything is basic <laughs> period um but i picked up this tna tank top this is the ribbed crop top and this was only 25 dollars. it is just your basic ribbed crop top now i do realize you can pick these up from zara zara does sell these if you want a more affordable version they're like ten dollars but i do really like the aritzia ones the aritzia ones are a bit more cropped so the aritzia one goes more cropped in the front i don't know if you guys can tell and it is a little bit longer in the back and sometimes i want that vibe sometimes i want to show a little bit more skin especially if i'm wearing something that's super high-waisted so i just feel like this was a good nice basic to have again these are really nice quality as well i have another one in my collection from aritzia but it's yellow it's like such a random color but i do really love the way that one looks and fits so i decided to pick up another one but in a more basic neutral color such as white so i absolutely love this top they're just like an essential like i said 25 dollars, which isn't breaking the bank but i do realize that you can get this type of top somewhere else but remember this video is about quality over quantity okay period that's my motto if you're not a quality over quantity type of girl this is not the channel for you i'm sorry go to the girls that have she in hauls you know what i'm saying that's that's giving the girls quantity okay Ooh, that was shade i wasn't trying to be shady to nobody though but it was shade okay babe so those are all of the new and items that i picked up from aritzia i hope you babes enjoyed this video if you did please be sure to give this video a thumbs up also leave me a comment down below and let me know which item was your favorite i love you babe so much and i'll see you in the next one bye